Yeah, I cannot wait for this. I love inventions and I love robots. And with me now is Kaylee and Becca. Welcome. You're from Bedford High. Mm -hmm. You work with a good friend of the shows, uh, Mark Smith. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is your robot. He has a name, right? Right. Miss Bach. Miss Bach. And tell me about Miss Bach. I mean, it looks fairly complicated, very mechanical. And I see all kinds of wires with electronics. Tell me what Miss Bach is meant to do. So what happens is they'll drive up to a feeder station on the field and then it'll feed frisbees into there and they'll drop down and shoot out. And then this arm right here, it'll hit over and hit a pyramid and it'll climb up a 10 foot pyramid. This will climb 10 feet up in the air? Yeah. How cool is that? Well, we don't have a pyramid with, with us, but I know we got some frisbees here. Can we uh, see how this works? I can throw frisbees and my friends notice all day long. <laughs> and finally, a match where I could throw frisbees all, like, all day long, right? Never tire out. Just go and go and go. Let's see it. Ms. Bach, launch one. All right. How cool is that? That is neat. Now, Ms. Bach, tell me about the uh, who had the brainchild to make Ms. Bach, and uh, what are his, where's Ms. Bach going? What's the uh, intention? Um, we work together as a team to come up with designs and then we work with a, um, an engineer and he will take it in and put it on CAD, which is just basically making a computer drawing of it. CAD CAM? Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah? It's, um, it's like compu computer-aided drafting, so Neat. they go and then they draw it out and then you can, um, you can print it off and you can go off of there and it's got all the measurements. And okay. So when did you uh, come up with this brainchild that you wanted something to throw frisbee and climb 10 feet in the air? Every year, um, first Saturday in January, we get an annual challenge, and then we go off of that, and we have all the students come up with ideas, and then we kind of morph them together and pick what we like, and the mentors will help us go through and pick what we want to do and pick how we want the robot to work. Okay, Kaylee, how many of you worked on Ms. Bach here? And how long, I mean, did you start in January? And I mean, how long mechanically did this take to put together? We have six weeks. Actually, our, um, our lockup is tomorrow at midnight. What's There's the lockup? It's where we have to take a giant, it's like a giant plastic bag and we put it around it and zip tie it. Uh -huh. and then we can only have six hours before our competition to open it up and work on it. Gotcha. And then um, 37 students and about 10-ish 10, 10 mentors that come in and work Monday through Thursday and Saturday. Neat. So what happens on Saturday? Um, on the Saturday practices or? Yeah. Uh, well, when, no, actually when you unwrap it, when you unwrap it, what goes on? Uh, when we unwrap it, it's basically get neat, get, you get done what you need to get done it's okay. whatever needs to be fixed like you can go through and if something breaks you can fix that you can improve on what you have you, whatever you need to do okay and uh, what's going to be your major competition <sighs> who knows mm. we never really know what's going to come yeah. up because we don't most of the teams we won't really communicate with until uh -huh. competitions start because no one wants to know what everyone else is doing so we don't we don't really have any idea what any other teams are going to bring to the table at competitions until we get there Okay. So it's really like, we don't know. No, we see uh, robots battling each other every once in a while. Ms. Bach won't have to do that, right? Oh, no. Oh. Okay. So <laughs> I'm not going to get too physical. It's just going to be for pure uh, amazement of what yeah, Ms. Bach right. can actually yeah. do. Well, we thank you so much for coming in. I want to load Ms. Bach back in before we go up to break. We shoot some more off as we go off to break okay. and uh, see what Ms. Bach can do. I wish we could see him climb to the top of the studio, but thank you, Kaylee. Thank you. Becca, so much. You. Good luck in the competition, and thanks so much for uh, sharing your inventiveness with us. Thank we you. hope you uh, do well, and uh, we'll go to break as we see some more flip frisbees flying through the studio. Go ahead, guys. Wow. I'm going to go catch one.